You know, when the, when the rain started really coming that entire week and we saw the Cumberland rising slowly at that point in time. And with past history in this building, we did know that when we had a steady rain, there were opportunities or possibilities for minor water intrusion. But on May 2nd, which was that Sunday, when it was just a, a solid downpour all day long, we, it's when we really started getting a little more worried and the alarms started going off in our pumps. And at around uh, 2.30 in the morning, I got, a, I got a, another call from our engineers saying, we've got issues. Well, I mean, it was a pretty surreal moment when the water started coming up out of the pits into the lower level four of the garage. And again, we had experienced that once before on a minor level, so there wasn't a lot of shock and panic at that point in time. It's when um, we started noticing it was coming up very rapidly. It was about 20 inches per hour, and we couldn't keep up, quite frankly. And then we brought in the ancillary pumps, and we still couldn't keep up. And that was, again, sometime that Sunday afternoon that we just realized there's, there's a major problem here. Again, I, I think the peace of mind probably was uh, that Monday morning. Uh, again, this was after the whole week of rain and then the Sunday drenching. The peace of mind was probably Monday morning, quite frankly, for me at 10 o'clock when Surpro showed up and then all the rest of my contractors showed up and we started to put together a plan of what, what were we gonna do? Surpro took on a commitment of ownership. And again, I'll say Surpro as well as all my contractors, but it, it couldn't have happened without Surpro's extreme team. It took on a commitment of ownership. I pressed them hard. I pressed them hard 24 seven to get it done. I mean, no was not an option. And I will say this, every time I brought something else to the table, they did it. When I said I needed a uh, portable generator large enough to run this building, they brought it. Air, they did it. Dehumidification, they brought it. They brought all the portable uh, fans. I mean, they did everything and they were there like that. And I can tell you, you know, we were worried about bacteria, we were worried about E. coli, we were worried about, you know, just the health and safety of all of our tenants and our employees. But after I saw what was going on and I saw the responses from every Serb Pro leader, I knew it was gonna get done. There wasn't an issue. You know, my thing is I, I can tell you that um, I would recommend Serb Pro to any of my peers across the country. I work with a lot of institutional ownerships, a lot of institutional insurance companies. I would recommend Serb Pro hands down above any of your competition because I now know what they're capable of and what they're willing to do to make it right. like it never even happened.